Welcome to another episode of Online Dating with Patsy, the podcast. Welcome. It's 2022. Okay, I'm a little late for New Year's, but I celebrate New Year's all month long. I hope everybody had a great holiday season. I know I did. I had a blast with my family, ate too much food, but other, you know, it was just, it was great. I had a great time. So the scammers are still out in full force, keeping me busy. So where do I start? Well, I have a conversation I'm going to let you listen to later because it's about a half hour long. It was from last night and it was an interesting conversation, but I'll go more into that later before I start it. Right now, I have some of my latest posts on Facebook. That Facebook, my blog. Um, I had an interesting conversation with someone over the weekend. You know, I always do the little line, you know, take a picture of yourself with three fingers in front of your face. Well, this guy does that, but I used the wonderful Reversi app. And what happened was the picture came up, but with somebody else's face. So I looked at the picture a little closer that the guy sent me, and I can see where he photoshopped in someone else's face. But if you go to my blog, you can see that picture and the comparison, and I show you how to see the difference in the pictures. I blew them up as much as I could without making them too distorted, but you should be able to tell the difference. I also posted two short stories from Special Agent Marie Smith from the North Carolina Bureau of Investigation. You'll have to go to my blog and look at those two short stories. She sends me good little tidbits every once in a while, so that's awesome. Another great one, which totally cracks me up, is, of course, another fake Chris Evans. But this one, you know, they always ask, well, how long have you been a fan? And of course, I said, oh, well, Johnny Storm did it for me. And if you're not aware, Johnny Storm was the first Marvel character that Chris Evans played in the two Fantastic Four movies. Well, as soon as I said that, he wrote back, who is Johnny Storm? Well, come on, give me a break. So that one, I kind of came back at him. But that's another good story. Um, St. Louis Magazine is taking nominations for their favorites. Um, there's a blog category under media and sports. They're only taking nominations till Monday, the 31st of January. So you can go to my blog and see all that information and nominate my blog. And if I make the top five, then in March, you get to, people get to vote. And uh, I'll let you know more about that later. I got nominated last year. I made the top five, but I didn't make the top three. So, but that's okay because it got more exposure for my blog people to go out and take a look and see what I do. So now I'm going to give you the intro. And like I said, this is about a 25 minute conversation. Um, it's in two parts. The first part was really very quick and he told me to F off, um, but I'm able to connect the two videos. So it'll go right into the next one. Now towards the end of it, you know, because he kept wanting to see me, and of course, you know, I put on my Jason hockey mask. And then I have toys um, that I put over it when they want a video chat so they see them. The one is my little nunzilla, and the other one is my robot from the TV show Lost in Space. And then, of course, Captain America. Um, but there's, when he's saying all this stuff, that's what you're going to see. If you really want to see my facial expressions, um, You'll go to my blog because I just posted this story um, because my my facial expressions are priceless. I can't talk today. Are priceless because I really made some <laughs> some doozies. He made me laugh, but he also challenged me. Um, but anyway, here is my conversation with the new guy. Hello, my love. Hello. Hello, my love. Yeah, how are you? I'm fine. How are you? I have missed you so much. The card you sent did not work. What happened? Why did you send an invalid card to me? The card did not work. It didn't what work. Did it didn't work. It did not work. It's an invalid card. 
It's an invalid card. Oh my god. I know why it's invalid. Because it's a fake card and you're a fake guy and you're not the guy in the picture. Oh, yeah, fuck you. Absolutely. What do you mean I'm not the guy in the picture? Because that guy's picture guy. has been yeah, used on me guy. dozens of times. Did he hang up? Hello? Oh, he hung up on me. Hello? Hello, why did you turn off your camera? Because you're not worthy of my beauty. Are you kidding me? You're beautiful? Like, how beautiful do you think you are? I'm very beautiful. You're so beautiful? Why don't you have your camera on? Oh, come on. You don't have are you not beautiful? beautiful? If I'm beautiful? Are you beautiful? I'm so I'm so cute. I'm so handsome. I swear, I promise I'm so cute. And you are not beautiful. Well, I, I know you're, you're not the guy in the picture. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you want? What do you want me to do right now? I don't need anything from you. You don't need anything from me. Do what makes you think I'm not the guy in the, on the picture? On the what? Well, why did you why did you play along when I was fooling you all along? Like I knew you when I don't really know you. You're doing all of that. What? If you had a, if you, if you had a past experience, how you was in you know, okay, well, why are you why are you? Oh no, I haven't had any past experiences. I just really I, I enjoy messing with you guys. <laughs> and you fell hook, line, and sinker, as my oh, one picture said. It's not funny. So you just you just go around wasting wasting time on the internet talking to every man that comes your way. What are you looking for? What is that that you want? Oh, I don't want anything. You don't want anything. You just playing around on the internet. It's men who contact me first, and then I follow back, and then they want to have a conversation. So I make the conversation uh, interesting and fun. This is not very safe for you, okay? You gotta stop. You gotta quit. Okay? If you're not interested in someone, stop wasting your time with them, okay? I'm not good at wasting my time. You just waste my time. And it also bad. I, I, I'm so mad at you right now. I can just do whatever. No! 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 What are you saying? What the fuck are you saying? No! I want to see your beautiful face. See how beautiful. Let me see how beautiful you look. I said no. What's that? No. Let me see how beautiful you look. You really want to see you me? Yes, I want to see you. I want to see you right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is me. You're crazy. You 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 are the main scammer right now. You are the scammer. <laughs> what? What? I don't need anything. I have everything I want. I mean, I'm writing a book. I'm writing a book about my adventures here. But I mean, I don't need money. I don't need anything. What Actually, need? I try to warn. I try to warn women about this you know <laughs> what can make you feel better what you're not coming through correct good hello i surely need me what do you need me i need yes, can you hear me why do I'll i need this. you why yes, do i need you i'm a very independent woman you are in the bed. I don't see you need me for some money or anything, but you are going to need someone like me in your life. I don't need money. I got plenty of money. Why are you wearing a mask? Because it's fun. <laughs> it made you laugh, didn't it? It made you laugh. You make, uh, I think I like you. You make me laugh. I made you laugh. See, I make everybody laugh. Everybody likes me. Um... 
I make people laugh. That's what I do. I'm a stand-up comic for a little, huh? Who do you talk to on the internet? Who do I talk to? God, I talk to... How many men? I know, I've never met anybody because nobody's real on here. Are you kidding me? Oh, no, I've had, like, God, fake celebrities. I've had so many Keanu Reeves, and I'm not even a big fan of his. I told you already about experience, that's why you're acting crazy. No, I'm just a crazy person in general, but I'm a crazy fun person. That's why I like you. I like how crazy you are, but I don't know. What What do you want me to do right now? You well, I just have some questions. Um, Do you really live in Nigeria or do you live somewhere else? Be honest. Be honest? <laughs> what do you mean, be honest? And then, like, what do you do? I mean, do you work? Do you go to school? Do you talk to strange women like me? You don't, what are you... What are you trying to know? What are you trying to figure out? Huh? No, I'm just trying to understand um, what it is you guys want besides money, you know. Or maybe you don't want money. What is it that you want? Oh, uh, Listen to me. I don't want money. I want someone I can be with. I want someone, I want someone that will love me for who I am and someone I can spend the rest of my life with. Well, see, I now, that's good. Why don't you use your own picture? I'm guessing you're probably a good-looking dude, you know. But yes, the problem okay. is, the problem is, for a lot of women in the United States, we want someone that actually lives near us and not across the globe. Okay. Okay, you're trying to tell me, like, a uh, majority of women in the U.S. They want someone that actually lives around and not someone across the globe? Yeah, see, I live in Pluto, Missouri, which is in the United States. Now, I if I was looking for a guy, and I'm not, I would want someone that lives near me. I don't want someone that has to travel or I have to travel. Get someone that lives close to you and is not perfect for you. What would you do? I'm sorry, repeat that? When you find someone close to you, but it's not perfect for you, know what you want in a man, what are you, what are you going to do? If I, are you saying if I met someone that lived near me? And it, it, it doesn't suit your kind of person that you want to spend the rest of your life with, what are you going to do? Okay, I'm not sure I understand your question. Can you rephrase it? What I'm saying is, if you get to find someone close to you, yeah. And it does it to be not someone perfect for you, not someone that you truly love, that's not someone that you need in your life. What are you going to do about that? I'm still not sure I understand. Okay, let me try this again. So you're saying if someone lives okay. near me, but they're not, I'm not attracted to them? It's about you being attracted to them. Listen to me. Everyone deserves the right person for them. Everyone oh, deserves yeah. someone that. What, what do you say? Well, don't, yeah, everybody deserves love, you know. I've already had yeah, my right. love, and I don't need love anymore. You know, that's just me. So you had someone, and you were just plain like you, you didn't have anybody in your life? I like Chris Evans, but, you know, I'm too old for him. <laughs> well, no, I'm you, serious. You, you, <laughs> What, what kind of man do you really want? I don't understand you. Well, no, I don't do really, you? I don't really want a man. I've been married. I don't want to get married again. I'm, div I'm divorced, and I don't, I don't really need a man in my life. I think you need a dick in your life, right? What? You do need a dick in your life. Someone that's going to make love to you, fuck you real good. I can make love to myself. Life. You cannot make love to yourself. That's not right. <laughs> Everybody can take care of their business themselves. They don't always need another uh, partner. I want to support that for you, okay? You need a real dick. A real dick. <laughs> that will make you much better, okay? A real dick. You understand? You don't need to take care of yourself. It doesn't make no sense, okay? It does make sense. So what sense. I'm saying... <laughs> What I'm saying. Okay, go what ahead. I'm is, I'll stop laughing. I want to know what you want. What do you want? I don't want anything. 
be honest? No, I really okay, don't. Better, I really don't. I'm alone. happy living alone. I mean, I have friends better, and people that I socialize good. with, but as regarding yeah. having a man in my life, I don't need a man. I'm not one of those women who are lonely. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. Listen to me. If you don't need a man, then stop playing around the internet. It's not safe for you, okay? I'm not you playing around. Me. I'm not playing around. I'm just having. I'm having a conversation with you. Why yeah, are uh, you pretending to be somebody else? Why don't you post yourself out there? Like I said, I'm okay, guessing you're probably a decent looking dude. Do you want to see me? If you want to show yourself, it doesn't. I don't really care. But if you want to show yourself you to me. You don't care? Yeah, I don't care if you want to show yourself to me. Your face. So, Nothing else. So, what is going to happen if you see me and finally you see that as a man of the photo? Well, then I'm going to say, well, if you're good looking as I think you are, I mean, I don't, why don't you use your own picture? Why do you pretend to be this, this old white guy? Are you a racist? No, not at all. I... I'm very diverse. I believe in everybody's equal. But I'm just saying, we why are. don't you be yourself instead of posing as somebody else? Why are you so focused in Africa and in Nigeria? Have you ever been to Nigeria before? Have you been there somewhere from Nigeria before? Okay. Have you dated someone from Nigeria before? Have you been there before? Okay. You've never been there? Have you been there before? Have you dated someone from Nigeria? Oh, me? Before? No, I've never been there before. But a lot of the young men on here that I've talked to, and I've talked to them. I'm not I'm not nasty to them. I mess with them. But then I usually end up having a conversation like this with them. You know? And then that's when they tell me how hard it is over there. And that, you know, jobs are hard and school's expensive. And, you know, that's why they come on here, try to get people to send them money, which is fine, you know? No. But you're not one of those guys, right? You're a good guy, I mean, right? You... Hello. I'm a good guy, but I don't, I don't, I don't want, want. Listen to me. Listen to me. Okay. Do you believe it? Are you trying to believe in me, or are you just trying to play around with me? No, I'm really trying. I want to understand this more. Like I said, I'm writing a book about this, and I want to understand more of this. You're writing a book of about my adventures online. I hate, don't like to call it adventures, but my experience and what I've learned, <laughs> you know. So, I mean, I like to hear from people from yeah, outside the country. But why, <laughs> my question to you is why are you pretending to be this other guy? Yeah, I want crazy girl. You want Cause this, crazy I have girl. to tell you, this guy's picture has been, <laughs> that's why I have a collage of his pictures because they've been He's been used on me so much in the last week. It's it's crazy. Well, what did he say? I said the guy that you're pretending to be, this, his pictures have been used on me like a lot just in the last week. I you for real? So you should find somebody else's pictures if you're going to pretend to be. How do you find those pictures? That's my question. <laughs> you're funny. You're crazy. <laughs> well, no, I'm curious. I'm curious. How? Where do you find you... these people's pictures to pretend to be them? I'm really seriously interested. You know me. Listen to me. You just want to understand what's going on right now. You just don't understand. Okay. So what I'm asking you is, what would you do if I show you my face and you see I'm the man on the photo? What would you do? I would save your picture, frame it, and put it on my wall. But it better be of your face and not some other body part. Because if you send the other body part, I send it to all my friends. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't matter. You don't have to show your face to me. I don't need to see it. But, I, you know, if you want to, that's fine. Are you going to put on your hockey mask? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a mask, okay? Okay. You don't have to show me your, your face. I don't, it doesn't matter to me, you know. So what would you do if I'm not the man of the photo? 
I know you're not the man. I'm not a big. I don't care. But I know you're not the guy in the picture. I'm saying you don't. You know, I'm not. A, I'm not a man on the photo. You haven't seen me yet. So this, what you're doing right now, is wrong. It's totally wrong. You don't know me. Stop calling me names. Okay. Well, no, that's fine. But I'm asking you a question. Why do you pretend what? to be these other people in the pictures? I'm just curious. I, why are you sure that I'm pretending? Because my picture that I have on my profile is me. So now, I put on a little weight you? since that picture because I'm working from I'm home. Just, but that is my picture and that is me. And that other picture I sent you was recently when so I went out to breakfast. I'm asking, I'm asking you this for the last time. What would you do if I... If I show you my face and I'm not the one on the photo, what would you do? If you're going to show me your real picture, I would be like, fine. I mean, nothing there, nothing would happen. Nothing would change, you know. But, I mean, I would see and, that you're at least being honest, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So you want to you wanna, you wanna, you wanna frame me and put it on your wall? You want I, On my wall in my living room, I would put your picture up. If you don't want me to, I won't, but... If you're a good-looking guy, I'll put it up. <laughs> and I'm guessing yeah, you good. are. I'm, You know. I mean, yeah, let, let's put it this way. The other guys who have actually showed me their faces, none of them were yeah. ugly guys. They were all decent-looking guys. So? So why did, you kick, why, did, why did you go with the flow? Why did you kick it with another them? What? Why did you try something with none of them? Why didn't you... You don't lie. Like them? Well, I mean, most of them, they admit right up front, you're right, I'm not the guy. And then they show me who they are. And then we have a little conversation, you know, and then that's it. I only have one conversation. I don't continue on. You know, like after we're done talking, you know, I'll be on my merry way. And you'll be on your merry way. Let me ask you something. What? Hello? You are dating them. What? Hmm? Were you in a relationship with any of them? Will I ever be in a relationship ever again? I don't know. I mean, I don't know what God has in in in, in uh, up for me. You know, He may send someone my way. I mean, but I'm not actively looking. You know, I kind of leave it in God's hands. If He wants me to be with someone, He'll send them my way. I don't know how religious you are, but um, I mean, that's just my thoughts. Well, if really God can send someone away, then. Why, 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 why don't you, why didn't you try something with this man that, what? that, you, that you came across? What? Why didn't you, why didn't you try something with the man that you have met on, on here? Why didn't you try something? You're breaking up. I can't understand what you're saying. But I can hear you clearly and I can understand you perfectly. Profit you? Is that what you said? I don't make any money on this. Absolutely. Not until I sell my book, but I'm not done with my book. What are you talking about? I don't understand what you were saying. You were saying something about profiting you. I don't know what you mean by that. Unless I misunderstood you, which is more than well, likely. Just let me talk to you. Listen to me. I didn't say none of that. I said, I can hear you clearly and perfectly. Okay? That's what I said. Okay. Yeah, listen to me. So we have to call this long story short. And um, do you think we can continue talking from today? Or you just doing this so we can just stop talking? What? <laughs> <laughs> Where are you? Let me see you. Well, let, let me see you. Let me see you under mask. Where are you? Are you still? You want my you, want me in my mask? <laughs> Your mask off, I want to see how beautiful you look. <laughs> Where are you? What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of girl are you? I'm a what crazy girl. I'm a crazy fun girl. 
that, that's why that's why I'm going to I'm, I'm going to want you. I'm going to like you. I'm going to keep you. Everybody I likes me. Crazy. Everybody likes me. Uh, I've yet to meet a person that doesn't like me. I think I like you too. So what are you going to do? <laughs> stop. Just can you stop? Can you stop this? <laughs> I have more toys. <laughs> I want to see your face. Stop playing around, okay? Stop playing around, okay? Stop this, okay? Are you a kid? Are you a baby? What do you do with all of these toys? I love toys. You love toys? Oh, what okay. person? Toys. What person doesn't love a good toy? I don't like it. She better stop it right now. Take yeah, she's she's face. she's Nunzilla. That's what she's called. So I'm asking you if you wanted to continue talking, or you're just doing this because you want to put an end to our conversation, and we get to know ourselves. So. Well, I don't really have anything more to say. I mean, I think you should go find someone that's closer to your area. I'm not. I'm not looking for anybody. Oh, you're not looking for anybody? Well, that's cool. But it, I want you. I want to get... What? No, I, want, I want you. I like you. I think... Uh, I like me, I too. I like you. I think I want you. I like me, too. <laughs> I'm fun. I have a great <laughs> sense of humor. You know? Um, <laughs> like I said, you know, everybody likes me because I am so silly and I'm so fun. And other people okay. like my toys. <laughs> okay, are you gonna push me away? I don't feel like I don't feel like leaving. You don't feel like leaving. Where are you going? No, I don't feel like leaving. No, I want to be. I want to be stuck with you. I want to be stuck you with me. Oh, that's real sweet. Excuse me. Do you like me? Do I like you? I think you're a very good conversationalist. I like talking to you because you challenge me. You talk more than most of them, you know, and you express your thoughts very well when I can understand them. <laughs> Whatever, but you don't know. You, you are, you're not planning to end up with me anyway. So you don't oh, I'm going to end up with you anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so you want to marry me? Is that it? Yes, I'm planning to marry you. You want to marry me? Do you love me? That's important. You got to love me. Yes, you got to love me and my toys. Yes, I want a crazy girl in my life. Yes, I want you and your toy. There'll be never, a, you'll never have a dull day. You will always uh, laugh. Uh, I think I want you. <laughs> I think I want me too. <laughs> I have to say, you make me laugh, and that's not always easy because I'm always the one cracking jokes. Mm -hmm. you no, know, from now on, you you won't be the only one cracking jokes. I'll be here to make you laugh as well. <laughs> about that. <laughs> What's that? My horn. <laughs> uh, My horn. No, I wouldn't take none of that from you. Okay. <laughs> I'm. I told you I have all kinds of toys. I got more, but they're across the room. What's the other thing I want? I have lots of toys. I like sci-fi stuff. Okay. Let me see you right now. Let me see you right now. I want to see you stuff. Okay. Okay. Let me see you. Hey. We stop doing this. <laughs> This is no fun. This is no fun, okay? It is fun. I don't like it. You don't know. We just might end up being together. I'm going to whoop your ass for doing this. Oh, you're going to whoop my ass. I might like that. <laughs> 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 oh. oh, look, it's getting.
getting late and I'm tired and I want to go to bed. Isn't it time for you to go to bed? Or what time is it where you are? That was a crazy conversation. Jesus. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that little conversation. The particular picture that um, this guy uses has been used on me so many times. He's what I call a repeater. And at the beginning, which I forgot to mention, he had asked for a Steam card. I started the story out like I knew him, like he was my long lost love. And then I told him, I said, hey, I still have that $5,000 that you um, gave me to hold. I want to send it back to you. So then he goes, well, can you get a Steam card? I said, oh, of course. So I pretended to run to Walmart, found a fake one online. I sent it to him. And that's why he's like, why did you send me this card? It's invalid. It doesn't work. So that's, that's why I forgot to tell you that part at the beginning. But I guess in a way you could say that I baited him. But I didn't send him anything, and I didn't expect anything from him, as I never do. But anyway, that's one of the little tricks in my bag that I used. And it's amazing how many guys will fall for it, send me bank account numbers, and think I'm going to send them money. But chances are I'm sending this money to a money mule from what I've learned. So so no, like I say, don't send money to people you don't know. It's, it's bad, 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 bad. Okay, now, um, I want some feedback from all my listeners and fans and everybody out there. Um, what else would you like to see on my podcast? Um, is there something in particular? Um, do you want to be on my podcast? Do you have a story about being scammed? Do you have a story um, how you met your significant other through online dating? Um, anything, just let me know. I'd like to know what ideas you would like to see, what things you'd like me to look into, because I want to keep this interesting and I want to keep you coming back. Again, I could talk for hours about the subject, but I, do you like the audio videos? That's, are the audio conversations? That's what I want to know. Do you like it when I post these on here so that you can listen to them? Um, you know, give me feedback. Patsy Podcast at att.net. Drop me a line or go to my blog. I have a contact form there, www.onlinedatingwithpatsy.com. That's today's episode. I hope you learned something. I hope it was entertaining. Check on your elderly women, friends, relatives, neighbors, cousins, sisters. Make sure they're not falling for these kind of scammers online because it's really important that we try to shut them down. And if this is one little tool that I can use, I'm going to use it. So remember this, never send money to someone you don't know. <laughs>